guys, welcome to the sixth episode in my Predators The Concrete Jungle Fallout 4 mod series. And we are continuing straight on from the previous video where we had started the Colonial Marines Wasteland Adventure mod. Now, it does get a bit harder than I thought it initially was because the uh, synths at the start were a bit of a pushover, but we run into some mutants and I do die a couple of times. Now, anyway. I hope you enjoy and let's get into it. Right, we've got to head to North Fort Hagen Piper. Let's go. Um, I've been there before because I've killed, killed Kellogg in the uh, last video, didn't I? Fort Hagen there. So, just north, I think. I think it said. Right, north. Yes, it's north. The north. Oh, what's that? Gunfire. Can we get involved? Anyone to kill? Ooh, that wasn't very nice. There's two of us. Nice. <laughs> I didn't, didn't realise that the uh, those animations were like just throw them. Oh, it's literally it is right north of Fort Hagen. I have some more nasty um, androids inside there. I wonder when we get to the see the aliens. Right, I should fire up this. Can we fire up this? Oh, it's around there. Silly me. Go. Movement detected. Oh. Ooh. These ones. These ones are doing a little bit more damage. Can you help me, Piper, please? Nice of you to finally decide to help me. Oh my life. Ooh. Hold on. Will that shotgun that I picked up? What will that do? Oh no, that that doesn't do much damage. That doesn't do much damage. Um. Ooh. I forgot I had that mod installed the, with the bit for the beam katana. Does it actually do more than the? Oh, it literally does. Oh no, it does do more. Let's go. I installed this um, beam katana mod because I thought it sort of suited the predators. How can you possibly block a sword with your fists? You are an android, though. To be fair. It is a shame this game doesn't have more melee animations. Oh, these are actually getting more difficult to kill. Especially this guy here. What the hell are you doing up there? How... How is... How are we even supposed to take that guy out if he's up in that corner? Oh, go away. Commencing termination of organic life forms. No chance. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh! Don't slam it like that! How rude. Oh my god, these things are so annoying to kill. I'll actually take an absolute beating. Go on, Piper. You are right up in that corner. Spear gun with any ammo? We have no ammo for the spear gun. Do I have any for the cross? I thought I had a crossbow. I have this uh, 
Alien weapon. And that does absolutely nothing. Have a pulse grenade. Oh no, 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 no. I think the co the combi sticks are quicker at that. Better to use a combi stick. Yeah, this is so much better. Attacks are so much quicker with the combi stick. Right, these guys were actually... I can carry something if you need me to. Well, not, not difficult to... Right, let's help Piper up first. What's up? You alright? You're fine. Um, yeah. These guys were a bit more difficult. They didn't actually do too much damage. Too much damage. It's just they took forever to die. Right, crewman Bog's blog. Crewman Bog's. Well, there we go. As we were traveling to our destination, we managed to find a small cache of parts in a warehouse. We're lucky we found them because the APC almost broke down on the way. The terrain is tough. This place has been bombed to hell and back. It's getting late, so going to grab some shut eye and detail the area tomorrow. When we got to the relay tower, it was it, beside an old abandoned town. Most of the buildings were boarded, but we found a few scattered supplies to use. We managed to get the radio working. The Slarko reports that they are having some mechanical difficulties and may have to alter their orbit off the planet. Captain Nance reports that some of the androids on board the ship started malfunctioning and going rogue, but have been shut down till they can sort out the issue. We got overrun last night with some type of Walking Dead things. Killed half the men on our team, and our camp is destroyed. We also got a Mayday from the Solarco. Somehow we had Xenomorphs on board the ship. Ooh. I bet that's why there's Xenomorphs on the bloody planet now, isn't it? Somehow we had Xenomorphs on board the ship, they got loose. The commander was keeping something from everyone and now we know exactly what it is. They've killed almost everyone on board and the ship is falling down out of orbit and supposedly crashed on and has supposedly crash landed on the planet. Her locator beacon has her crashed someplace out in the ocean but we can't get a good read on on it with this radio, so we may have to give up on this and go find the Solarco instead. It no longer matters, the walking dead things are attacked again. Everyone is dead or dying. If we could only have gotten to Relay Tower 1DL-109, it's northwest of Oberlin Station. That's where an APC crew was sent to next. Go find them, tell them about Solarco, and that we didn't make it. I know where Oberlin Station is. I, I might, I think I've already got it on my map somewhere. Are we ready to go? We are. We're good to go. I've got to be close to getting to the Salaka then. Might have to, uh. I'm unsure, like, if they've crashed and there's loads of xenomorphs, that might be. that might be very difficult. Right, Oberlin, Oberlin Station is where we've got to head to next. Uh, okay. Civil alert broadcast signal. Oh, that is that because we've picked that up? Right. Mm, we want the map. Oberlin Station is... There. I think... I think if we just head well, fast travel to Oberlin Station. Yeah, I'll just quickly mention I will have the link to the 
this uh, quest mod, this Colonial Marine quest mod in the description below. Right, where, which way did it say? Should just be, yes, there, I thought it was that way. Along with, yeah, I'll put the, as I was saying, I'll put the mod description, uh, the mod link in the description below, along with all the other mods that I use. I mean, I don't think there was uh, much need for that. You are very, very violent. And that's coming from me. What have we got here? Fire up this relay tower, shall we? Excuse me. Thank you. I forgot uh, <laughs> how much these uh, are you compa how much your companions got in the way sometimes uh, in this game. Yes, I'm present. Oh my god, what the hell are you? No, no, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Okay. Okay. I... Nope. I was not expecting that. At all. That thing... ...was insanely strong. Oh, God, I can't, I can't bait them out of the APC either. Um, oh, this is going to be a bit, a bit difficult, I think. Piper, go inside, go inside first. A death Walker. Bloody hell! I could do, I could really do with some. Um, could do with some. Any crossbow? I've only. Uh, what's that? I'm walking on to. Oh. Right. I'm gonna go ahead and quick save it in case I die again. That thing was insanely powerful. Like, insanely powerful. I need to run away from it. Oh my god! Let me get through the door! Right, I can, hopefully I can keep that table between me and that thing. Go, stay away. Right, Piper, you deal with that thing. Uh, oh, Piper, I'm sorry. really need to use my vats more often. That thing is horrific. Yeah, vats. I keep forgetting about vats, man. Stun lock in the room. Absolutely stun locked. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, you're right, you're right. I'm sorry. I think I hit her. I'm sorry. Most folks are just looking for a hand. All we gotta do is offer. Okay, okay. What the hell is this? That item is too heavy. I want to drag it. Right, we'll take that. Some Xeno blood. That thing is actually horrific. It's like a. It looks like a pathogen mutated. Ghoul. No way. Uh, it's just definitely gonna get this mission's definitely gonna get harder from now on. Lieutenant Arno's lock, right. Let's check this out. Lieutenant Arno.
We're coming to the east side of the city. It's funny because my aunt used to live in that Natick. The town of Nat Nat Natgit we drove through is nothing like the Natick I knew. This whole place is like the 50s exploded with nuclear power. That's not really a funny joke, but the joke nonetheless. Something did explode, just not sure what. What could have happened here to cause this level of destruction and ruin? A full-scale nuclear war. Not sure <laughs> what I want to find out because it may end up happening to us. We follow the parameters of the mission set up. Set up our APC near the radio tower and attempt to connect to the solar code but didn't receive a signal to or from them. Hopefully everything is okay. We did hear a civil distress call but we have been unable to act, locate the source or shut it down. This place is some strange nightmare. Radiation is everywhere. Walking dead. And with everything being in ruins it feels and sounds weird. We heard the mayday for the Solarco last night, but there isn't anything we can do from here but pray. We did attempt to contact some of the other APC crews for orders or what we should do, but we got no signal. I'm really not liking the sound of this with every passing day. No way to contact command and supplies running low. The whole mission is in disarray. The mayday said they had xenomorphs on board. What were they thinking? We came here to escape them. Why bring them with us? Good bloody question, mate. Well, now the APC is broken down as well. I guess this is the end of our mission. We were going to try and head to Relay Tower OSC-527 east of Fair Fairline Hill Estate to see if the APC crew sent there are having any better luck. Wait, what are those huge green monsters heading towards us? Gotta go, they're attacking. I hope we survive. Really, they are not having the best of times, are they? Not at all. God, that is her. I can't believe how that, that actually looks so cool. That's exactly what I'd ma I'd imagine um, a pathogen infected ghoul would look like. Wonder what else? Uh, there are quite a few mutations I think, that you can come across in the Commonwealth uh, with this mod installed. Right, it's fair. The Fairline Estate. I don't think. I've been anywhere there yet. Fairline Estate. Where, where am I now? I'm there. The Fairline Estate, I think. It's somewhere down here somewhere. I'll have to have a quick Google just to see where it is and then uh, come back to the game. Where is... Where's Piper? I'm sure she'll turn up. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one.